Oh man, finally decided to upload one more video and this time I'm presenting you guys day 9, 10 and 11. Uh, I know I've, kept, I've skipped quite a few and I will probably upload the video with uh, day 6, 7 and 8 but hey, for now let's stick to this one. So for day 9 I've decided to actually try attempt a painting of a man. And this time I'm painting kind of a king because I'm trying to represent the card of the emperor. And of course it kind of had to be a man, I don't know. I mean, I could have painted a woman and name it the emperor anyways. But I've decided to stick to it and it's actually a good challenge since I don't normally paint men. So here's my attempt to it and I actually thought that um, I would be painting, I would be trying more my drawing skills and using more the dip pen but it turns out I do like using ink in washes just like I use watercolor and I'm more comfortable with it. Anyways, later on once it's dry I did take my dip pen and I did try to do some line work but I just find it so contrasting and I just, I don't know, I'm not, I'm not comfortable enough with the dip pen yet with the drawing i'm so used to just using ball pens that it, it it just gives me it just gets me scared but anyways still working on it right now we are on day 18 and as soon as i finish uploading this video i will get back to it and i will be playing probably with half halfway through with the dip pen and then wash it just because I found it's the perfect combination for me um, about painting men and about painting this card I'm just not comfortable enough with them but it's because of lack of practice and I know that as soon as this challenge will be finished I will continue practicing just because I find I'm kind of not comfortable enough with it anyways Day 10, I've decided to paint the Wheel of Fortune. I had this wonderful idea of just making a ring with some dead plants and some um, beautiful fresh plants, but it kind of went downwards. I'm not very proud of it. And I will probably reattempt this card when the challenge is finished, uh, just because I feel like I didn't make it justice well anyways um i haven't been proud of it i thought it was quite simple and just contrasty so later on i went back to it a bit later on and i've decided to add in some uh, gold ink and then i felt so sorry about it uh, just such a nightmare anyways um i'm showing you guys here only the part that i've done the first time where I just put solid black <coughs> sorry and then some uh, washes and well I had such a beautiful idea for it and it just went downwards but hey art is like that and I'm still learning and on the process I will probably fail many times and not fail some other times so I'll just roll with it Okay, so then for day 11, things were a bit better. I've actually decided to represent the devil. And of course, quite obvious, I decided to just paint a girl with horns. And it's not the best repre uh, presentation of a devil, but hey, uh, just decided to practice my profile looks and just have fun. It was a loose painting. And one that probably took me uh, about 20 to 30 minutes in real time and it's just because I'm starting to get so tired it was also the day before the pilaf festivities are here in Zaragoza in Spain and it's a big huge uh, festivity and I was going to dress up and spend the <coughs> spend the day with the family so yes had to rush through this one i will probably repaint it once the challenge is finished but i hope you guys like it 
so this was pretty much it for those days um i'll go ahead and upload what i have and i hope you guys like it so here's a finished look at the paintings i do actually think that for as small as they are they still look cute well they're my babies of course i hope to see you guys in the next tutorial bye